I guess what I really want to ask is like, what can what can we all do to to um, help you and yeah. help your cause? Uh, so. March. Marching is good. Just in um, place or anywhere marching. in particular? Just keep marching. I feel um, like this is like aerobics. Knit your, knit your pussy hat. If you don't know, I'll be, I'll Wait, be in the audience those? later and can show you how to do that. Um, <laughs> right? And uh, This one doesn't have horns. It's not for Jews. Yeah, you have to put it on and then it kind of sticks up. I'm not okay. a really very sophisticated knitter, I'll be honest. Pretty hat. Yeah. I know it's flattering, you know, yeah. flattering to the, to the skin. Uh, so marching is good. Calling Congress is good. Going to town hall meetings and raising hell with your member of Congress, super good. But most important, voting. Okay. Yeah, voting. voting and donating. And donating. Donating yeah. is always good. Um, time, money. Any time, of money, all of that. And I think, look, you know, everyone, every time I go outside, someone says, like, what, what should I do? What can I do? And I think the most important thing I can say as an organizer is just, like, don't wait for instructions. You know, just... I shouldn't have even asked the question. No, I think it's important because... Um, I think the most exciting thing is I'm seeing women everywhere who are just taking things into their own hands. I, I was just back in Speaker Paul Ryan's district yeah. in Kenosha, Wisconsin. We have three health centers in Kenosha, Planned Parenthood does, and women there are organizing like crazy. Um, they've organized 1,500 uh, women called Forward Kenosha, and they are now recruiting folks to run for office in Kenosha, Wisconsin. So that's, that's awesome. To me, that's what we have to do is just um, everyone has to do more than they ever thought they were going to have to in their lifetime because we need to. Yeah.